Hello friends, welcome on this video tutorial. Today Daniel is here on tips to fix to show you Windows 11 updates on unsupported computers on 2022. I have a lot of comments on the earlier video on Windows 11 and supported computers if we are able to get updates on, on this year in 2022 and then I'm here today to show you that I'm able to update on the lasted Windows release. So let's go directly to the point and check. Open up start and go to settings and here on the settings let's go on the windows update let's see the version of windows i have right now uh, for the moment i have this build i have this one 376 and let's see who is the last one and if we see here on the history the i'm here on this version okay and this version is released on uh, uh, 14 december 2021 so with the last one the last one is here 438 Okay, and it's released uh, yesterday, <laughs> okay, and today is uh, 18, 18 January, and uh, so let's go and check now if we are able to update on this version. Go here on the settings, and then back here on Windows Update, check for update. Okay, the reason I'm not in the lasted one for the moment is because I have uh, paused these uh, updates for a, a week or more. The reason was to make this video tutorial and see if the updates are working on this unsupported computer. And uh, till now everything looks okay. Oh, look at this. We have here security intelligence update from Microsoft Defender Antivirus. Another one here, 2022, okay, 01 cumulative update for Windows 11 for 64 base system. So let's see this code. I will remember this 795. Let's go back here. Here it is. You see 795. Okay. 501 795. Here it is. 5010795. Download and install. It's downloading now. Look at this. Okay, okay, pending to download. Let's see if this will work. Okay. So I have that many questions how this Windows uh, 11 is performing on a computer, unsupported computer um, in 2022. As you see, for the moment, it looks good in asking me for restart to install the updates but I will click here not now <laughs> because I'm talking with you guys and you want to see my computer but I will it's saying pending to download this will continue download after the restarting pending restart for this pending download for that let's do the restart the computer right now and then let's come back here after restart is done let's go again to Windows update and let's see here pending install samsung electronics ltd usb okay i have a device here who is connected and he's searching for drivers these are only driver and then here it is the cumulative update that we need this is the lasted one it's downloading the update okay and it's maybe it will be three or four gigabyte Mm -hmm. It's the full update, okay? And let's see the version now that I have after this mini update that I did. We are still here on this build, okay? But we will go on the lasted one today. If you want to see if my computer meets the requirements, I will show you right now. PC health check, okay? Here it is check now no yeah, this <laughs> this PC doesn't currently meet Windows 11 system requirements because of my processor now this processor is currently not supported okay let's go again to Windows update and see it's downloading 99% let's see the update history and then here it is we have this 
lots of updates for framework. We have updates for driver updates, definition updates for Microsoft Defender antivirus. That's important for security reason. Okay, let's go back here on Windows update and see we are installing the lasted version of Windows 11 25% of installing on this unsupported computer. It's installing the Windows. Okay, pending restart. So now we are able to restart the computer, not now. And then let's see after installing this last update, how it looks and what's new on this, okay? Okay, let's see the system here after restarting the computer and update is done. Go to the system, go to about now, and then, oh, here it is. We are on the 438, the lasted version. It was 438. Let's see it again here. Okay, 438, the lasted one. Okay, what's new on these versions that we didn't know? So we have color filters and taskbar icons and some uh, fixing on the system. Okay, so now let's see and color filters here on the settings go to accessibility and then color filters okay interesting you can turn the color filter on red and green you can use this one interesting option blue yellow how it looks oh <laughs> okay grayscale invent okay i will turn off this color filter i don't need that so as you see windows 11 on unsupported computer is working well and then updates are working as well as you see and then we don't have any problem till now okay if you have any other questions or difficult on installing windows 11 then comment me and i will respond to you god bless you see you on the next video tutorial